Welcome to another math lesson from MonumentalMath.com. Today we'll be solving one-step equations that have negative integers. Okay, I have one with multiplication, subtraction, addition, division. We'll do them all. We do the opposite operation. Here it has 3 times x equals negative 15. So we'll divide to undo the multiplying. These cancel. We get x equals negative divided by positive is negative. 15 divided by 3 is 5. Done. This one, the opposite operation for negative 7, so subtracting 7, would be to add 7. Okay, so then you get x equals. Now, if you have negative 2 and a positive 7, you can think in reverse. If you have positive 7 and a negative 2, it means you go backwards. If you had $7 and you spent 2, you now have 5. If you can think money, it helps. This one says negative 6 plus x equals negative 20. Opposite operation. The opposite of adding negative 6 would be to subtract it, or you can think of add a positive 6. Okay, on this side, they go away. You're left with x equals. Now you have negative 20 plus 6. If you're in debt $20 and you pay off 6, you're not so badly in debt. So you're in debt 14. So a negative 14 becomes that answer. Last one is down here. X divided by negative 4 equals negative 3. Opposite of dividing by negative 4 is multiply by negative 4. This one in the denominator cancels that one in the numerator. You get X equals negative times negative is positive. 3 times 4 is 12. Done. And that's how you do it. Now you go ahead and give it a try. MonumentalMath.com. Solving one-step equations having negative integers. Good luck, and I hope you enjoy the challenge.